In this video, we're going to rate and, of course, review Breach Thousand Year Blood War Episode 5. Tama kayo na ako dyan. Yun lang. Anyway, well, keep on watching. It's kind of tough to watch, bottom line. But, let's not get ahead of ourselves, guys. First order of business, the thumbnail. Obviously, Ichigo looks defeated. And, yeah, he was. He just found out how, well, he just found out in this final scene how powerful the Quincy's are. Ang dami nga rin. Ang dami nga, ang dami nga nalaman dito. Tukos sa, tukos sa, tukos sa buho ng kontrabidang to. And, wow. Hence, the shock look on Ichigo's face in that thumbnail. With that in mind, let's get to the nitty gritty of this episode, guys. Face! It had a slow and excruciating pacing, but, uh, Doon nagsimula ang battle scene between Ichigo and Yuwak. Yeah, yeah. Of course, the pace is picked up. Do I have complaints? No. I am absolutely more than satisfied with the pacing of this episode. Kasi nga! Well, it's living true to its title. Bleach Thousand Year Blood War. Ano namang tarunin kagal ni Ichigo? Ang, ang big bad ng anime di, in, uh, this early. No! Meron pang inintroduce dito na, na twist eh. The lead characters are in crisis right now. Kaya mga maranamdaman nyo rito sa pacing ng episode. Go naman! The first gear shoot here was when of course, each go face off uh, against Yuwa. No brainer there. Because kung tinagal pa nila ang uh, ang uh, slow and excruciating pacing, baka mawala ng interes ng tao. It's about time these two bulls face off. Just goes to show you how, uh, yeah, how Yuwak is very much in control of the storyline of this episode. Talagang, mararamdaman nyo rito eh. Dito pa lang sa gearship na to. Final gearship, of course, dalawa la. Because, um, we, oh, Yuwak gave an inkling here that Ichigo is his son. That's a gearship right there, folks, because it completely changes the complexion of this anime. Aba, ano to Empire Strikes Back? <laughs> Probably the biggest gearship so far in this uh, in this reunion season. Right there. That's why it's called it. That's why it's a gearship, guys. So these two gearships that I saw, um, ni. Okay? You will totally miss out on the battle scene if you only watch these two gear shades. So I strongly recommend that you watch the entire episode. Blood lies. There was a quick backstory sequence here regarding uh, Genryo Sai. Pero, um, lumalabas flashback lang kasi pinatay na siya ni Yuwak dito eh. Kumbaga, um, lahat ng, kumbaga, probably the most important uh, scene in his life na recall niya dun at that moment. But it's still a backstory sequence. Therefore, Bloodjado ang blood, guys! I love the way which cinches in those backstory sequences eh. Kasi, uh, it's totally relevant to the current, uh, to the, to the moment's continuity. And, mapakaama ng mga part of the original continuity eh. Okay? Lalo na yung scene na yun when Debbie size of recalling that moment. So, well, art out loud, guys. So, base, flow, and plot, they all came together for this episode, folks. Talagang, <laughs> it was tough to watch from start to finish. Got it. So, Bleach Thousand Year Blood War, episode 7. Yup, episode 7 nga. <laughs> Alam nyo, um, hindi ko pinatatagal ang bawang review na ginagawa ko ngayon eh because uh, I'm a bit sick right now 
and uh, just want to get through this and give you my insights on every um, anime episode being reviewed in this uh, for for this week as quickly and concisely as possible. So of course, I, I don't want to waste your time. So in the meantime, watch the next review. So again. Reach thoughts on your blood war, episode 7! Two thousand!